Hey guys, so I've got a brand new dish on the new James Italian menu that I'm really proud of, uh, using lamb, British lamb, brilliant quality, um, and the technique of cooking it is quite interesting. I was trying to kind of like rift off of what would a lamb version of a porchetta be, right? So the idea of rubbing the lamb with beautiful things like chopped up parsley, anchovies, uh, ground coriander, seasoning, a little vinegar, uh, a little garlic, and then slow cooking it. Slow cooking it blonde, so it's utterly tender, but held together, right, rolled up. And then our job is to get it really, really crispy. So uh, then what we do once it's tender is that. Crispiness, you know, really get that happening in the pan. And you've got that wonderful contrast of crispiness and tenderness. Once you've colored this up a little bit, we're gonna pop this in the oven. So we're gonna just get that nice and crispy. To go with that, there's a great Italian dish called peponata, which is with peppers. So beautiful red and yellow peppers, and we sort of braise it down with beautiful ingredients until it's sort of sweet and sour. And that, with the lamb, is a phenomena, right? So let me just show you how we do it. Um, we get a pepper. I don't want to waste any, so just push your thumb in the hole like that, bust it open, and then we want to just lose the seeds and the stalk and then we're going to hack it up into chunks kind of like inch random chunks but nothing too uniformed we're going to fry that off now keep moving it about half an hour sometimes a bit longer and you want to encourage the natural sweetness out of the peppers so i've got some nice red onions here just going to quarter it and chunk it up all nice and rough for me, I love making peponata. It's a wonderful recipe to master in your home. About sort of 10 minutes in, I'll add the garlic. We're gonna use some beautiful capers as well. And a little bit of lemon zest, just to freshen it up. Just the lovely yellow zest. We'll season this peponata with pepper and salt. But look at these colors. So now, what's gonna happen now is the natural juices will come out and it will start to soften. And then we'll cook those juices away and the natural sugars will start to caramelize. Delicious. And that is what we get. Um, I did a small batch just before and that's how it looks when it's done. So you can kind of see the difference in texture, but beautiful colors. And of course, if you've got green peppers or orange peppers, you can kind of get amongst it with all of that and then just nice little wedge of parsley. Just by adding that lovely fresh parsley at the end, it's a freshness that's just, it's really delicious. Really, really nice. And then we're gonna serve it with a salsa verde, which is parsley, mint, um, bit of basil, garlic, capers, anchovies, mustard, olive oil, and a bit of vinegar. It's the most delicious green sauce. Um, I'm just gonna waz that up in a food processor and this is nice, we make this every day. Keep it fresh, keep the fragrance of those beautiful soft herbs in there, but it's great with any grilled meat. It's great with actually any roasted grilled fish, uh, beautiful grilled vegetables. Salsa verde is a real fundamental of the Italian kitchen, uh, but you've got to keep it fresh and delicious. Let's plate up this lovely lamb dish. I think it's really nice, that blend of soft, tender, and crispy bits. We all love crispy bits, come on. Um, the peponata, you know, is deep and rich, not just in colour, but also flavour. Look at the colours. The colours are exceptional. Look at that. So rolled breast of lamb. A lot of love and care gone into that. And then salsa verde, chef. So we just whizzed up those ingredients and then balanced it with oil and a little vinegar. And that's it, lovely people. A little bit of salsa verde over the top. Simple but delicious. And some beautiful pea shoots to finish, and they taste sweet and gorgeous. And there you go, lovely people. A delicious, slow-cooked, crispy rolled lamb with peponata and gorgeous salsa verde. And this will be on a special today and for the next week I hope you enjoy.